Module 4.2, The System Builder, Race and Meeting Trends Analysis. Welcome to Module 4.2 of your Proform Professional Training course. In this module, we will look at how you can research the trends of a specific race and trends for a meeting or mini festival. How to use the System Builder to research race trends. In this session we will look at how to find the past winners of the Grand National and the Derby and show you how you can run multiple presentations which in turn will allow you to look through to find any race trends. So we have Proform open and we'll open the System Builder. We'll hide the buttons and size the screen and we want to work on the Grand National and to find the past races. So the first thing we know about the Grand National is that within the name it says Grand National. We also know it's run at 4 miles plus. So if we do greater than 7 or 4 or yards, which you can see from the lookup, is 4 miles. And we also know it's run at Aintree. So we go to the courses, select none, and then select entry. And we'll just want to see the winners of the race to start with. So in the horse tab finishing position, we enter one. And we'll present the results by year. Then run the system. And we can see it returns one winner for each year the Grand National was run. If we double click one of these, we can see that it was last year's winner, Neptune Colloins. So now that we've found all the past winners for the Grand National, we'll take the finishing position one out of the system build and run it again. And we now get all the runners as well as the winners for the past Grand Nationals. So if you were now looking for race trends, you might say, let's have a look at the presentation by age and this shows you then all of the past winners and losers of the Grand National presented by age. There will be lots of presentations that you want to go through to look for trends in the Grand National such as SP rank, weight in pounds, weight rank, finishing position last time out and so on. So rather than run one at a time, you can just use the report buttons up the top. So if we click on report on all race, course and horse filters, as you can see, each presentation is automatically run. And a report is entered into the recent reports list. So if we scroll back up now at the finished and click on horse age, we had the same report that we did manually at the start. And we can then start going through weight rank, weight in pounds and so on to analyze the data to see if there are any trends. So let's do the same again but this time for the derby. So we'll reset the variables, clear the recent reports. We know the derby is run at Epsom so in the course list we just select Epsom. We know it's a group one race so in the classifications, we just select group one. And we know it's a turf race. And of course, it says Derby in the name. We then present by year and then run the system. And you can see we found all the Derby races from 98 to 2012. We double click on this year's and we can see Camelot was the winner at 8 to 13. So again we could now use the buttons at the top to run off all the presentations in one go. And once all the reports are run you can start going through the reports to find any trends. So the particular report we've got on the screen is SP rank of the Derby winners. And we can see the front four in the market represent most of the winners. 
So you could then narrow down your derby selection by adding in the front four in the market into the analysis by entering less than or equal to four in the SP rank field. And if we just run that again, we can see the SP ranks just come back less than or equal to four. And if we to just set the presentation now to bottom line, we can see we would have had 14 of the derby winners and backed 62 runners just using that front four in the market trend and made a profit of 16.49 points to Betfair SP. And if we present by year, we'd have the winner in all of the last 14 derbies were won by horses in the front four in the market. So that's how you find a particular race and how to analyze trends using the multiple report buttons. How to use a system builder to research meeting trends. In this session we will show you how to find all the past winners and runners at one meeting. In this case the Cheltenham November Open meeting. We will then go on to show you how you can build up a profile of past winners at this meeting. So we're back in Profile and already in the System Builder. And we first need to find all the Cheltenham Open meetings. We know, of course, they're held at Cheltenham. And we know they're held in November. We also know they're just Chase, Hurdle and National and Flat. And that should be enough information to find the Cheltenham November meetings. If we present by day and run the system, we should be returned three days for every month of each year. So in 1997 we have three, 98, 99 and so on. Down to 2011 which run the 11th, 12th and 13th. We can see there were six races at each meeting and that's a number of runners and the six winners. And if we just double click, we can see we've got the correct races selected for the Cheltenham Open meeting. So if we change the presentation to bottom line and just run again, we'll now see a total of 3,103 runners and 269 winners from all the past Cheltenham Open meetings. So it'd be a good idea to save this as a baseline for trends for the Cheltenham Open meeting. But first of all, we don't want this to be a system that shows qualifiers on the welcome screen. So we go back to the date tab and untick this box. We then save the system and we'll call it Chelt Open Stats. Click OK and the system saved. And now we can begin to do analysis of all these past Cheltenham Open meetings. So for instance we could go to the presentation and click on Trainer, run the report this shows all the trainers records at the Cheltenham Open meetings. So just like the race trends instead of doing one presentation at a time we could now click on the report all button and let the system builder do the work. So this will now go through all the presentation reports and run a report for each one and drop it into the middle of the recent reports screen and then you can go through at your leisure and look at each of the reports. Once all the reports are finished you can then go back and look at each individual report and begin to build a picture of what trends perform well at the open meeting at Cheltenham. Well that's it for the module 4.2 training session. Trend and meeting analysis can be very fruitful. Try out trending more races and meetings using the system builder.